Hey guys, I'm Boston Jay. This is Wicked Pissa. And if I can find a way of helping some of these folks cross over into the light, well then that's what I want to do. I really, really want to do that. I want to go back because I want to face my fear. I, uh, I think there's something evil in that house. If there's somebody in this room, can you come to this little device I'm holding in my hand and talk right into it? Joe, Joe, Joe. Joe. Come on. You okay? You all right? You may not attach yourself to any of us in the name of Jesus Christ. It, yeah, I just got that cold breeze. It got really cold. You heard your name? Yeah, it was right in my ear. Ethan, Ethan, Ethan just got knocked Ethan just got Ethan, are you okay? Bro, bro. Oh, let's go. Let's you go. okay? Let's get outside. Heavenly Father, protect us. I told you guys this place is freaking horrible, man. Let's go. Let's get out. Use all your energy. Take the energy from the batteries in my camera here. Yep. Scratches. You got three, three scratches. Look at the hair. Look at the hair standing up and goosebumps. Look at that. Look at that. Dude. What? Goosebumps and the hair is standing up. There's you something here. Let's, Let's get out. Let's get out. Okay. I gotta say, uh, it was the creepiest place that I have ever been. So um, I will. Uh, I'll see you guys on the flip. And um, remember to like, subscribe, and comment below. And uh, we'll be talking to you again soon. So we're just going to walk a little bit through here. Um, as I said, I don't think I don't think the place is haunted per se, um, but it it can be kind of creepy. Um, there are some hiking trails here that uh, you can walk on. There's a lot of areas where there is um, wildlife. As a matter of fact, I see something right now. Let's check it out. This little guy's eating. He's going to town, chowing away. Can you see him? That right there is a gopher tortoise. And um, they live underground most of the time. Um, but he's pretty cool. He's gonna hide. He doesn't want to talk to us. He he's hissing a little bit. <laughs> he doesn't want to talk to us at all. Which is fine. I mean he can, you know, he can hide in there. <laughs> he keeps poking his head in and out. You hear him? <laughs> you hear him hissing a little bit? <clears throat> well, we'll leave him alone. We'll let him eat his dinner. <laughs> but uh, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool just the same. So, uh... Yeah, let's go off in this this direction here, and we'll see what we can get a, get into. But that was cool, a gopher tortoise. Awesome. Lots of wildlife in this area. 
I mean, it's a beautiful area. I love it. I mean, I've been here a few times, and um, I'm, I don't think I'm going to do too much um, walking or too much uh, video, uh, only because I, um, I left my cane at home. And I mean, I can walk without a cane, okay? But I just, you know, I, I usually like to have it with me just in case. But this particular time, I just left it at home. I didn't take it with me, and I should have. So let's see what else we can find. I thought that gopher tortoise was pretty cool. Yeah, he was, he was hissing a little bit because he, you know, he didn't want to be disturbed. But look at this. Look at how beautiful this place is. We may see some signs of, you know, fire. Uh, some of the wooded areas might be a little bit burnt up or something. Uh, not too long ago, in the spring, there were a lot of wildfires that came through the area. And sometimes they do controlled burns in here just to, you know, re alleviate some of the some of the pressures, I guess. But it's pretty cool. Nice and it's quiet. Here it is very, very quiet. I don't know, it's got a I got a just a, a weird feeling about this place. You know, it almost feels like almost feels like you know I shouldn't be here you know um, that's I, it's a little weird but that's just I mean I'm allowed to be here it's not a place where you shouldn't be trespassing this is uh, it's it's a um, conservation area and this hiking trails so you can go through here but um, yeah Let's see if there's more um, more wildlife or signs of it. I'm just going to be, be quiet for a little bit. I just want to listen and see what I can hear. Um, I, I'm hearing, I hear lots of birds. Of course, I mean, this is the time of day where most animals are getting ready to wake up and do what they got to do. Oh, there's a velvet ant. I don't want to step on that. But I mean, I'm looking in the sand. I'm seeing I'm seeing lots of little footprints from uh, you know, different uh, different birds, different wildlife. Um, I haven't seen anything more than you know, 
bird prints. I figured something like this place would be kind of a cool little video. Something, you know, to change things up a little bit, you know. I mean, I know, you know, doing, um, you know, haunted videos and stuff like that is that's cool I dig that I really really like it but you know sometimes just getting out in nature should be you know just as good um, I really enjoy nature I like being out it looks like the trail kind of closes up right here I've come here once, once before with my um, my son-in-law and my two granddaughters, two, the two older granddaughters. Um, we came here one time going geocaching. Now, if you don't know what geocaching is, look it up. It's really, really cool. It's a lot of fun. It's like uh, it's like treasure hunting, you know. I I really, <laughs> I really liked it. It was a lot of fun. So, uh, yeah, look it up, geocaching.com. It's pretty cool. Sorry about that. Camera just died. <laughs> I guess uh, the problem with this camera is sometimes it'll it'll record for a certain amount of time and then it just shuts off by itself. Another thing we have a lot of around here is uh, wild rabbits. In fact, I have I have a lot of wild rabbits that live on my property, which is fine. I mean, they're not a nuisance. They're not bothering anybody. But, uh, you know, every now and then my cat will bring me a, a baby. Leave it on the doorstep. It is so eerily quiet. It is so quiet. And I don't mind, you know, I don't mind the quietness. That's kind of cool. That'd be great if I could see a deer. Be awesome. They're probably all hunkered down somewhere. Look at that. Is that the creepiest looking tree you've ever seen? See if I can shed a little light on it for you. Look at that, huh? Creepy. I'm just going to be, again, I'm just going to be a little bit quiet walking through here because I want to see if maybe, you know, if I'm walking around flapping my gums, you know, if there are any animals around, they won't, they won't come out. So hopefully if I'm quiet enough, we'll get somebody, 
we'll get some animals on here other than that go for tortoise It looks like there was a vehicle that came through here um, probably either earlier today or sometime yesterday. A lot of times the county you'll have some, they'll have workers that come and they check this place out. Today's a good day. Well, when I say today, I mean tonight because it's actually uh, it's actually close to seven o'clock and this is great okay I was gonna say the trail kind of ends right here <laughs> and now we're getting into more forest so yeah if I'm quiet enough maybe some animals will come out There's a nice breeze. I got about nine, two minutes before camera shuts down by itself again, so I guess it only records in like 10 minute increments, which is, that's okay, I don't mind that so much. Another trail that goes off that way, I'm not going that way, I'm going straight down here. Eventually, the, this will bring us right to the uh, to the lake. I mean, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I'm going to try to, you know, I'll try to edit it down a little bit so that it's not so long.
Yeah, you see how some of these trees have burnt a little bit? See, some of the trees have burnt up a little bit. They must have done a controlled burn here not too long ago. So everything's kind of burnt up a little bit. As you can see over here too. They really burnt up those sago palms. All right, this is going to shut down for a minute. I'm going to walk a little bit further, and um, then I'll do some more filming after, after a bit. Now, I just happened to be walking by and I noticed that. Now that's a pretty deep burrow. Don't know what is in there. I'm not gonna find out. There are too many cactus around the area and I don't wanna get stabbed up. I'm not wearing pants. So uh, that's as close as I'm gonna get to that. But it's pretty cool. I don't know what's in there. Let's see. See, as I said before, so many signs of wildlife out here. That's why I like it out here. You know, it's really cool. Now, unfortunately, as you can see, it looks like I've come to the end of this particular trail. I mean, off in the distance, you can see, you can see the lake. It's there. 